It's a wonderful show, the Newark show. You can see all sorts of fantastic things when you walk around the, uh, around the fields, and uh, this in particular has caught our eye. Uh, it's a Nova, but not like a Nova I've ever seen before. I'm with its owner, Frank Fernando. Frank, tell me a bit about the car. Um, it's a car that I purchased over 16 years ago um, and completely rebuilt. It's been rebuilt three times um, in, in that period of time to basically get it to the stage that, um, that I'm satisfied, which, which is um, in its pr present condition. It's fantastic. There's so many different modifications to the original. Yeah, uh, the main modifications really are the body, body styling is very much similar to the existing Novas. Um, I've got the pop-up headlights, which are a little bit unusual, certainly for this car, and the, uh, the air intakes for the uh, to, uh, to cooling for the turbo. Turbo? Yes, it's uh, powered by a Ford RS Turbo um, power point. Well, most Novas are powered by 1600 rather asthmatic Volkswagen Beetle engines. Um, so what did you have to do to, uh, to fit an RS Turbo in there? What I did was I actually um, contacted a, a gentleman who specialises in building dragsters um, because I felt that you know, I wanted a job done that was actually going to work. Sure. And uh, he, what he was able to do is he produced a, a, a purpose fabrica purposely fabricated fl flywheel and a clash, clash assembly um, and installed the, um, the engine to make with uh, using adapter plates, obviously, to its, to its gearbox. So what sort of BHP have you got going through there? Um, it's been uh, calibrated at just over 140 brake horsepower.